Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. I just posted a video a minute ago regarding a uh, Russian convoy moving through Mariupol towards Zaporozhye. And according to the Ukrainians, and um, um, there was a Ukrainian uh, news media outlet, it was uh, Ukrainska Pravda, the article had a picture over there with, uh, you know, saying um, the Russian convoy, more than 100 units moving through the town, blah, 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 or whatever, going to uh, Zaporozhye. And there was a picture over there that I showed and I pointed out that the picture had no, in the picture it was a uh, Russian, I'm assuming it was a Russian um, armored vehicle and um, behind it, so behind it, behind uh, the armored vehicle, I'm going to show you the picture, uh, were some trees, but the trees, not only the ones behind, like behind the side, they did not have leaves. So that means that picture for this current article, supposedly it happened, you know, today or yesterday were seen, uh, did not have leaves. Let, let me tell you, in Ukraine right now is the same as, uh, let's say, in uh, Michigan or in Ohio, this kind of temperate continental uh, you know, uh, weather, how you want to call it. Yeah, the leaves are full, full blown and all that. You see the crop over there ready to be, uh, you know, picked from the fields or whatever you want to call it, sown or... Nevertheless, I don't know how you call that. But anyway, picked up from the fields, cut from the fields. So here is um, the picture again. So I can, you can make a, um, you can remember it maybe. Uh, once it's, it makes it uh, clear behind, you see, there's no... Uh, no leaves in the tree, in the trees. Now it's not because of the bombardment or something. Uh, and then I want to make another point. So this was today, a minute ago. And I, someone posted this on Facebook. I picked it from Facebook and uh, it's in, uh, in Romania and it's made as a joke. I will uh, cover it a little bit here, but uh, I'm going to show you the picture and I will comment it why I'll show you the picture. You see here, it's again it's from Ukraine, and you see over there there's uh, uh, cars uh, upside down, but that's not what, what, what the main thing is. The main thing are, look at the windows, the white framed windows behind those, those, uh, those cars. Oh, what the hell, I can do it a bit better than that. So those white frames right there, you see, they are new, new windows. And look at those cars over there upside down, bam, 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 and to the side. And those windows are nice and clean and nice. Boom. That's the first point. And now, <clears throat> this is what, in Romanian, this article was sent to me, this picture. He says, I'm going to translate it. I don't care who bombarded the zone and created the air that, you know, the, from the explosion that turn the cars upside down, the three cars, because one was on the side, on the right side of the picture here. So I don't care who did that, but I'm interested what company, what Ukrainian company installed and produced those windows that resisted the explosion, that survived the explosions. So he's making fun that this, uh, <clears throat> this uh, cars were torn upside down and destroyed by the explosion but the windows did not crack and I think that's a funny funny not uh, thing so just look at those pictures again uh, and then make a make a make your own conclusion it's just I'm just pointing it out I don't have a, a um, I mean my theory and that's a fact it's not just my theory is that the people try to impress you know uh, when they uh, make an article, they try to uh, pick the most relevant images that they have and they don't really pay attention to this aspect because people don't really pay attention to the details. It's, oh my God, it's a uh, armored vehicle over there <gasps> going through their town. Oh my God, see, uh, that's awful. And it makes a, an, an, um, an impression, a visual impression. The same thing with this. Oh my God, look at those cars over there, uh, upside down, destroy, destroyed. Oh my God. Mm. That, that's the, the desired uh, feeling. And, um, you know, they try to create the image of it, obviously, with the article that tells you the, probably the article that was with those cars and 
oh my god the russians uh, destroyed this and that which probably they did <laughs> but i'm just saying this that was weird with those uh, with those windows now i have no way to know if those uh, let's say uh, the ones with the windows were photoshopped or not and i don't really care you know why because i saw so many pictures of the same kind in different wars that were before and i know for for a fact and i mentioned that in the previous video that i made when there was the scuffle how do you want to call it the war in yugoslavia with all those columns of um, you know um, they were t saying that um, serbs are um, ethnically, ethnically cleansing the other you know the croats the bosniaks whatever there was over there the albanians the kosovarians the uh, they were doing this they use the same picture the same the same sometimes the same column of people uh in different <clears throat> uh, in different articles talking about different uh situations different locations but with the same group sometimes and i picked that because as i said in the other in the other uh video i would pick let's say a t-shirt of a kid or some someone an adult having a t-shirt let's say of uh, a football team a soccer team however you want to call it and i was thinking oh look at that because you know it was just jumped and i said oh God, that, that, this guy likes i don't know let's say manchester united or like maradona or um, i don't know um, argentina or something and then you see the same guy in a different picture in a different location a different kind of a, a person different kind of situation circumstance but the same guy because the same shirt oh my god the same shirt and you see oh that's the goofy guy or the guy with bearded guy i don't know with his eyes uh too close or something that would stick in your mind and you say what, what wait, wait a minute but then those were newspapers not internet at that time for me at least uh looking at those things and uh it was uh like Mm, something is strange here, but I didn't you know. I was young. I didn't really care about those things. But it, I, I remember they were strange because they were talking about this. And then when I listened to another guy saying the same thing, and his name is uh, <laughs> a very politically incorrect name, but I will try to make it in such a way that you can find the guy. He's dead. Uh, he died in 1993. No, in 2003. See, that tells you I'm old. If you start um, missing decades old so uh 2003 he died he was a doctor in physics and his name uh, his first name is william and uh, the last name starts uh, with the uh, letter p from pp all right so william p and uh, he's a doctor he used to be a doctor physicist anyway so um he mentioned that in one of his uh, speeches the same thing and i was like oh wait a second i remember that i remember that yes 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 he's right about that one too so just point out to this and i will look for more examples if i am just you know i'm not gonna like oh my god where, where is it they will appear they will come and i will just say oh <laughs> that's the same thing here now i know i understand that well let's say when you talk about uh, let's say bill clinton they like to put pictures of uh, bill clinton in these kind of circumstances sometimes they don't want to put you the accurate one like he's a ghost or something but i understand that kind of thing but when you uh, you talk about the current event and then and uh, uh, some piece of news of oh my god those russian bomb or bombarded uh, i don't know the capital the kiev and they destroyed the parliament building i want to see that picture don't see me don't show me the parliament picture uh from i don't know uh three years ago when it uh, was renovated or something i don't care i want to see it then and i think i'm man enough to watch whatever destructions were over there don't try to uh protect me from a uh, ptsd or something seeing things uh, i'm beyond that all right so thank you very much for being with me again today stay strong stay smart look for the truth and be just